everyone welcome back to my channel my name is Blokis how you doing it's good to be back again and today's class will be on how to make a flutter sleeve due to the request I got on one of my videos on how to make an A-line dress which I make use of a flutter sleeve so all you need is just a little fabric so I'm going to be using this leftover fabric I have here and all you have to do is to fold on bias Can you see that so after folding on bias, make sure this part is towards you. You can see the opening is just a half circle, a flutter sleeve or a flat sleeve. Then you will need your measuring tape and then your ruler. You need also need the half of your handhold measurement. Like mine is eight and half. So all I'll do is to place it across here to get a straight line of half of eight and half. But remember, you will need one inch for sewing seam allowance that would make it nine and a half of nine and a half then i will advise you just you know to avoid some mistake you can add extra half inch to the nine and a half inch to make it ten that is totally optional so all you have to do now is to get your ruler and your measuring tape and then measure that nine and a half to get a straight line this is what i have that's good then make a straight line can you see that you will need to insert your cap's height for me it is four inches so from this bicep line because this will not be your bicep line so four inches from this point now connect to the end of the line get the midpoint that is half of it go up by half an inch from this point connect to the hand see that you need your hammer curve to curve this then so that you won't have like an inverted curve here i'll just advise you to go up by quarter of an inch can you see so you can rotate the curve so you just make this point straight due to experience so that you won't have it curved can you see so for the front arm hole you connect to the main line and not the one you went up by so we are done with the head of the sleeve you can now determine the length of your sleeve for me i usually make it 14 with seam allowance of 15. so let's just assume 14. pay attention here then you keep rotating can you see that 14. You get to the end part here so instead of that 14 you just go down a bit or move your measuring tape to somewhere here can you see then you keep rotating it so 14 is here now can you see that so her sleeve is ready see how pretty the sleeve looks like so it's very very easy then you can cut it out can you see what I have so make sure you notch this before opening it up This is what I have so beautiful for so what I will now have to do is to trim the front ham hole let's do that gently so can you see that so her beautiful sleeve is ready and you see that so you just need to use this as a template to cut out the other one if my tutorial on how to make the flare sleeve has been helpful Please make sure you give me a giant thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. You can share your beautiful dress you make 
attaching your flesh sleeve with it on our Facebook group so innovation or tag me on Instagram Loki signatures I love you guys bye